Hey guys, I decided to do my first haul for you guys. So I went to GNC. As you can see, this was a large haul. Well, large for GNC. But a lot of things they had on sale. $1.24, guys. $1.24. That's more than half price most of the time. These are were $1.24 too as well. And the thing is is they still had it where if you bought five, you got one free. So actually, it made them a dollar and four cents each, more than a dollar twenty-four. So big win. So I got all of them that was marked down to a dollar twenty-four, and all of this flavor, the sour cream and onion, that was marked down to a dollar twenty-four. And then I got these. These were not on sale. Well, they were the regular, you know, buy five get something, get one free. So, um, because I like to get the most out of my money, I guess, and they, these were $2.99. These were also $2.99, and I have not tried the Fit Joy yet. I haven't tried the Enlightened either, but I haven't for sure tried the Fit Joy. So, um, they were all $2.99, so I bought five, and I got one free. This No Cow was also one of, on that deal for $2.99, buy five, get one free. So, I got one of these things for free. And I haven't tried any of this stuff. So look for future episodes where I am going to be te taste testing this stuff. And these, like I said, was $1.24. Again, buy five, get one free. And then um, I've been really interested in trying the Quest Protein Powder. So I like that they sell the individual packets at my GNC. Now, one thing I want to tell you that I learned about GNC last night is... Um, they are franchises. So every GNC may be slightly different in what they carry because it will be up to the individual owner of that franchise what they carry in the store. So um, if one GNC in your area doesn't carry something you're looking for, check the other GNCs because we have about six GNCs in our area and they are all owned by different owners. And so they all carry slightly different products. So it's something to keep in mind. And then we went to Costco. And I got some clothing for taking the kids to the park. They were a pretty good deal. And I was able to get size large, guys. That's huge for somebody who used to be a 3 to 4X. Yeah. And so, anyway, then I um, got these chicken skewers, which I have heard on a... I have not bought them before, but I have heard on a lot of other... YouTubers videos uh, for Weight Watchers Freestyle that people are just loving them. So I tr decided to buy them, but wouldn't you know it, they were also giving out samples of these today. So I actually got to try them and I won't say they were the best grilled chicken I've ever had, but they're, they're pretty good. And for zero points, I'm going to have them in my freezer for quick and fast meals sometimes. And just on the go, they're great for that. And I'm going to make my own Ziki sauce to go with them. So I actually bought these um, these little tiny cucumbers. You can't really see them. They're kind of like the um, Eng they're like tiny um, miniature English cucumbers. So they're seedless, but they're little. They're really cute and tender. But anyway, I'm going to use those and some of the non-fat Greek yogurt. And also, now this is from Sprouts, but I'm going to go ahead and show it to you. I got the fat-free feta to also go into the Ziki sauce. So this will be a free or zero-point Ziki sauce when I'm done. So awesomeness there. Then I got the sweet onions at um, Costco. I got two of these. These are Weight Watcher Girl's best friend. They are so versatile, so yummy, and so low in points. Crazy low. And I got my mushrooms for, you know, my every day, every morning omelet I got to have my mushrooms. And I got bananas. I'm cutting back on the amount of bananas I'm getting. They're only like a dollar and 25 cents or so usually at Costco. But, and so I was getting like three bunches a, um, a week, but the kids start getting tired of them. So I'm still going to get one bunch a week though, because we each eat one on the way to, um, church on Sunday mornings. So... You know, it's a quick car food. Then I'll eat them for snacks, The rest, whatever we have left after that for the rest of the week. Then I got the kids. This organic 
kind of like Go-Gurts, but they're from Stonyfield. And this was only like $5 and some change. So a really good deal for 24 of those. And my kids love those. And so that was all I got it. Oh, and they also had toilet paper on sale this um, month. So I also got two huge things of toilet paper at Costco. And it all came up to like $150 for like everything. This was a ton of stuff to me. And then we went to Target. And they had their Valentine's Day stuff on sale. So this is a little um, teddy bear with a heart um, cookie cutter. I use it to cut sandwiches and stuff. And, you know, I don't see what is so Valentine's Day about a teddy bear and a heart. So I'm not going to be using it for Valentine's Day. I'm just going to be using it for every day. And it was half off in the Valentine's Day stuff. And then I got this one, this OPI, because I love OPI. And the color I have been looking for for a long time. They had one pretty close to it a few years ago with tulips in the name. And I haven't been able to find that exact pink again. Now, this is not the exact pink, because I don't think they ever do the exact color twice but this is pretty close and I also got it because of its name which is let's focus focus I can't see I'm trying to make it focus for you guys but anyway it is the Cosa Melted in the Sun and we went to Cozumel on our honeymoon almost 18 years ago so I had to get that for the namesake alone <laughs> and then I got the famous sugar-free Hershey Hershey syrup that everybody else is talking about as well I haven't tried it yet I'm really not usually a fan of, of Hershey syrup but I'm gonna give it a try anyway and we this was the real reason we went to um, Target is our soap dish in the bathroom just disappeared one day and we have not been able to find it and it's been like two or three months now so we finally broke down and just went and bought another one. And I got metal so that the kids can't break it as easy. Yep. And then I got this. This was my favorite find at Target. 79 cents a bag for these frozen vegetables. Um, I've got a recipe that I'm going to be doing later this week. That I'm going to be sharing with you using these. But I can't believe they were 79 cents a bag, y'all. Um... Vegetables usually are at least a dollar on sale and sometimes two dollars a bag. So 79 cents. That is super good deal Then we went to Sprouts My my daughter only likes the super orange and I give it to my kids when they're sick I happen to like the uh, pineapple coconut the best so we buy big things of the pineapple coconut But when my daughter's sick, I get her the orange one. So I just got some loose ones and then, like I said, I got the fat-free feta, which I can't seem to find anywhere else but Sprouts. So, got that for the Ziki sauce later this week. And I got the bulk um, quick oats. It was 69 cents a pound this week. This is only like two pounds, so this was like less than a dollar and a half for all this oatmeal. This will last me weeks. And then the grapes were 98 cents a pound, so I got a couple of pounds of that. And then I got to the freezer section, y'all. This was the best find. Now, this one I've had before. Love this enlightened flavor, the birthday cake. It's one of my favorite. But they had brand new flavors. The movie popcorn or movie night. I have not, I didn't even know this flavor was out. Uh, the French toast is another new one. I had no idea was out. The cookies and cream, another new one I had no idea about. And then I've been looking. For almost a year for these new ones, the Snickerdoodle, sorry about the lighting in here guys, the Butter Pecan, the Chocolate Peanut Butter, and the Brownie Cookie Dough. I have been looking almost a year for these. And the only place that sells enlightened ice cream in my area is Sprouts. So, you know, I was super, super stoked when... I seen these so I and it was buy one get one free that's why I went ahead and got this one even though I probably already have some in my freezer but I had to get it even now I also seen that they had a s'mores flavor which I had no idea there was a s'mores flavor either but they were out of that so um, at Sprouts they will give you a rain check that never expires so of course I got the rain check and I also have my husband get a rain check too so next time if they got the s'mores I'll be buying that too and then I forgot when I showed you guys my um, Costco haul, I also got that. So, 
yeah, it's a pad to stand on while you do the dishes or cook, cook or whatever, but it's like extra soft and thick and like a memory foam type stuff. So anyway, yeah, extra exciting. So that's my haul, y'all.